Chase Haggard, welcome. Hey. Welcome, go ahead, whenever you're ready. So, Mike, you said there's no ontology to logic? No, there is. It's in the mind. Okay, so the ontology exists in the mind? The ontology of logic is brain chemistry, uh, uh, electrochemistry in the brain. Okay, cool. So I can, whatever I predicate as logic is just logic because it's produced by my mind then, because there's no actual external ontology to what's going on in my brain. Yeah, so you can form logic in your brain, but the point is that valid logic has to have a specific configuration within the neural well, circuit. Well, well, you just imported valid. Let's slow down. You said that logic, ontologically, is just a product of the brain. So logic, to me, logic is sticky notes. What do you mean? That doesn't make any sense. Logic I agree. Is this is the result. It's a reductio ad absurdum of your view. Because logic where, is not something that actually has, let me finish, doesn't actually have ontological status. It's just a product of the brain. So my brain produced that this is logic. And you can't actually po point to or account for some kind of ontological thing called logic outside of the brain. You need to accept that this is logic. No, I don't have to because that's false. Because logic, as defined as through empiricism and evidence, well, wait, wait, is, as, you, as oh, defined hold on. by. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, you can't do this. You wait, can't wait, do slow this. down. You said before logic is ontologically just produced and in the brain. My brain produced that sticky notes. That's what this is what logic is. Yeah, that would be a false statement because Why? it's an identity error. No, but now you're now you're yes, appealing to some kind of error. ontology look, look, outside look, of what's listen, in the brain. Listen, listen, right? you're not listening to me. Ready? Yeah, no, no, I'm holding you to no, no, your no, first no. premise. Stop, stop, listen. Just no, I'm listen. not going to stop. Is listen. your first premise well, does that still gonna, stand? If you're not going to let me respond, hey, we, you do I, have to let him respond, Chase. Question. Let well, let him respond, Chase. So you're changing your whole premise. No, let me respond. Okay, go ahead. Change your premise. So. The statement logic is neurochemistry. That is empirically backed. And it doesn't, no, no, no. It, do, it doesn't on, matter what it's hold backed on, by. Hold on. I'm not, I'm not holding on. I'm stopping you before you go on, on a dish gallop. Hold it doesn't matter I, what you say no, it's backed no, by. No, if you no, say no, the I, ontology, listen. If you say respond, the ontology is just. Let me respond. Focused. Okay, hang on, hang on. You're both talking at once. Hang yeah, on, okay. Focus, hang on, he's hang just on. Hang on, hang on, Chase. Chase, please, please, hang on. I do have to. We, we do have to let him finish his answer. We have to let him finish his answer. And then if you object to something in the middle, then go For ahead sure. when he's done. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead, Mike. So when I say logic is neurochemistry, that is something backed by the evidence. And I use my logic to come to that conclusion logically. Now, okay. when What's, you say now when you on, say hang on, let him finish, let him finish, oh, let him finish, on, let him finish, on, Chase. Hold on. Hang on. When you say logic is a piece of paper, yeah. well, that's definitionally false because paper is not neurochemistry. That's an identity error. And we can empirically prove it with the evidence. And Your first premise is that logic has no ontology outside of the brain. My, yeah. Based on that first premise now, you can't say that there's something beyond what I predicate as logic, beyond whatever I predicate as logic is produced by the brain. By me saying logic is sticky notes, you can't now, you're, now you're importing all this other stuff that I haven't granted. And based on your own first premise, you can't back up. And then you say you start importing, importing hilarious, huge, sweeping statements. I interpret the evidence. Well, you are now importing a standard that you're going to need to evaluate good yeah, evidence and is, bad evidence. Is, no, no, let me this talk, is, Mike. Let me talk, Mike. Mike, let me confusion. talk. Are you going, Mike? Let me talk. Okay, I'm not finished yet. Okay, I'm not finished. There's that atheist love. There's that atheist love. Um, so again, you're appealing to now to some kind of ontological thing that you're going to appeal to for evaluating good evidence and bad evidence and what's logic and what's not logic. But based on your own premise of logic just being ontologically generated by the brain, I can say logic is this sticky note and you can't, no, you, you, you can't, can't point to anything. Right. That, that would be like saying this phone is a tree. That's wrong. Right. It's well, no, now you're appealing to ontology. No, if you just let me, if, actually you just, having if, you just, if you would just let me speak, you're a yeah. nominalist. No, no, listen, listen. So the ontology of logic is brain chemistry. And that's something that we can empirically prove. When you say proof is based logic, on a system that, that hold, appeals hold on, to. Yes, hold, it is. Yes, it's based on empiricism and logic. I Which agree. you would have to. But logic is what's in question right now. And if logic the is just produced by the brain, the yes. you're appealing focus. You're now appealing to all of these ontologies and you've denied access to ontology what, what because you're not, I, let me finish. What am I, what you am cried I about not letting people finish. No, no, no. Stop See, whining, is, Mike, focus. This is embarrassing. 
I know this is it is not how you just, debate somebody. Just so you, you know, when you try to do hang on, you're both going. You're doing it again, guys. Yep, you're I'm, doing I'm it again. My, like, both, hang, this, hang on, this hang on. You're both controlled. talking at the same time, though. Nobody can understand you guys. Has to be controlled. I, I know, I know, yeah, I, I know. Listen, focus, listen. Focus, hang on, Chase, talking. Chase, Come Chase, on, please. I'm, I'm hang on. The guy debating here. This is. Just I know, I know. Hang on, Chase, Chase, please, Chase, Chase. We got. We do have to give him the the opportunity to respond. You are just the caller here. Okay, make your point brief so that okay, he can cool. respond to it. And yeah. then, Mike, try to make your response brief because there's a lot of overlap with you guys talking. But, yeah, go yeah, ahead, Chase. So, so, again, every time you d you just tried to appeal to the law of identity, you just said, well, this phone pointing to ontology linked to an idea and a concept of phone is a tree. You said, oh, you can't do that. On your worldview, because you're a nominalist, you can't actually say that there's ontology to tree, phone, logic Why and not? not and something that's not, Why not logical. Why not? Why not? Because you can't account for ontology like fresh even just Why pointed not? out. Why not? Why not? Because they're produced in the, the brain. Ontology. Yeah, give an account because for the two brains. Because it's not a, here, not? Mike. Mike, why not? here's why. why not? Here's why, Mike. Mike, I'll I will say the contradiction. Two different brains can produce two different ontologies about objects in the world. Okay, and is that logically possible under your view? Yeah, but the, the okay, person who's describing something that is fallacious would be a false. How statement. do you have a standard of what's fallacious and what's not? By observing them. By obs I observe and verifying that this. Look, so look, now look. What? Do you, look, do you agree that I can verify that this is a phone and not a tree? No, not in your world. Do you not at all? No, 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 no. Why not? Why can't I observe this to be a phone? What and is not the a tree ontology of phone and of tree? Empirics. There, there's an empirics and there's empirics leads matter. you to truth. How do you account for that? And what is the ontology? What do you mean? Of what do you mean how do I, hold on. Mike? What's the what ontology mean, of the word empirics? What do you mean? How do I account for matter? What's like, the ontology I, of hold, the word empirics? Listen, what idea listen, ontologically listen, does that listen, point to? Listen, listen. What do you mean? I can't account for matter. What does that mean? The idea of categories. Matter, when you say the word matter, why you're can't pointing, I use my mind to I'm describe talking, matter? Mike, Mike, I'm talking. Why can't I use my mind to describe Mike, matter? I'm talking. You're okay, 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 hang on, hang on. Before you, before you finish, it, Chase, so we do need, we do, we do this need to make this your dishonest. final. Chase, this, Chase, Chase, hang on, Mike, yeah, Chase, Chase, both of you, stop, fine. stop, guys, stop. Listen, Chase, need this to be your final point because we do have to move on. We got a bunch of callers sure. still. Yeah, yeah good. I, I just think it's funny that the the child cries about being dishonest and interrupting, and then he interrupts. But uh, so again, the you're appealing to when you say matter, how can I not account for matter? You the word matter, you're using that word to point as a referent to point out an ontological idea. But you can't account yeah. for ontology and you've negated right. having right. access to any. I'm, I'm talking, right. Mike, Mike, right. I'm talking, Mike, I'm talking, Mike, I'm talking, Mike. You can't account for these things. You've even yeah, admitted I, it. And it's, it's to the it's to the mind. It's through the mind, which is yes. determined, and you have no verification principle why, to determine why what's true. I, why can't I determine things to be verified? What's your verification principle? The uh, the idea the idea that you can verify something to be true by observing by your the, verification principle is the idea that you can verify something no, to be by true. Comparative comparative analysis, right? And by, how do you compare what's true and false, Mike? By observing these things and seeing if they comport to reality or and not. And how do you know what comports to reality? By observing it. Using logic, using my brain, yes, and my logic. And logic has no ontological status. Thank you. This was very fun. Appreciate the, the it. The what doesn't it. have ontological status? All right. Thank you for the call, in, Chase. We we we, <laughs> we we can't matter, continue it. It's just taking yeah, up too matter, much time. Matter. Matter.